Hi you guys, it's me Q Johnson. Today we're back with another video and today we're going to talk about Baddies East episode 12. Um, the stuff that happened, I guess like a recap thoughts, whatever. Oh my god, I don't know why, I'm out of breath today. Like, I'm just tired. And it is Friday, no it's Thursday when this video is being recorded and this episode dropped like Sunday. So I'm like a week or a few days late. So this episode just, I don't know, like it just, it gave nothing. Like, we start off with, oh, I'm looking at my tablet, like, looking at, like, the screenshot, so I can, like, just follow me along, or whatever. Um, so, we start off with the Sapphire and, um, Smiley fight, and, um, Suki jumped in, uh, to me, Suki can do no wrong, like, Suki faces, like, a lot in the music industry, is, like, being darker skin, like, with the whole, like, you know, because, like, you know, like, a little colorism thing going on, and, like, Suki, she faces a lot more backlash than what she deserves, um, her music, like, her and Sexy Red, like, the type of music they do, guys can do the same thing, but they don't get no hate or backlash for it. So, when females, like, them do the same thing, um, they get hate. So, I stand to Kiana. I'm sorry. She just, to me, she does the wrong. Like, she gets a lot more backlash than what she deserves. Wait, she gets more backlash than what she just, yeah. So, she can do the wrong to me. So, I mean, hey. Um, the fight with Sapphire was pretty weak, like. It's probably one of the weakest fights this season, actually. Um, Natalie, she looks good in her confessional looks. Uh, still with just like, it's kind of like beret look or whatever. This looks really good on Natalie. Um, then we have T and DJ Sky walking in. And we're talking about DJ Sky for this part of this episode. Um, Automatic confronts her. And Automatic's like, oh, um, it's either you apologize to me or we're going to fight. da 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 and I'm like, this DJ Sky Girly, <clears throat> like swing anything. You let this girl, like, she was like, oh, like, I think she's in a lie, like, she's gonna apologize, like, it's no big deal, or whatever, like, it's no point in fighting. But, like, girl, she punched you out of that apology. Like, don't let nobody punch you out no apology. That's really what happened. Like, you got punked out of that apology. And you need to stand on business, because automatically, well, she's picky choosy. But automatically, she's still on business with DJ Sky. So I'm like, DJ Sky, like, how are you going to let someone punk out an apology? Krishan, if I was Krishan, I would smack you. Like, ain't no way. Ain't no way I could have my friend get punked out an apology for defending me. Defending me. And you are, you, automatic, you, DJ Sky, you apologize for defending your friend. Mm, 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 mm. Who child? Um, then E.T., she confronts, uh, Taseki, and, um, uh, Taseki, she looks, this ginger hair, this orange, whatever this color is, looks good on her. Um, E.T., she's like, E.T., she just stand on business, you guys, and she was like, oh, she's wearing red fingernails, I've never noticed that till now. Look at this, it's actually cute, you guys, see? She's wearing, like, the red fingernails. Um, I just now saw that, but, um... She, she's like, oh, she want an apology. And second, she's like, apologize for what? Because, like, apologize for what? Like, if I'm defending somebody, why do I need to apologize? Like, I don't get this. Like, if I would defend my sibling or my friend, why should I apologize for defending them? Like, no. And to second, she, she gave Anamak um, her purse. Like, her my purse. And um, the cast was like, no, 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 no. Uh, just apologize, because, like, they saw the way Taseki ate, but E.T., Suki, Sapphire, they didn't see, like, the fight, because they wasn't, like, in the house yet. Yeah, and, I don't know, I've seen everyone, like, I've seen, like, a lot of people was, like, oh, but that would have been, like, T, E.T. would have popped her, and I don't know, like, I don't know, I don't, I don't think so, because, um, the type of time E.T. me on, it's, like, she just wanted more, like, of an apology, and then, like, T, that whole situation was, um, I think I would just produce the fight, honestly. Um, yeah. And why everybody got, like, these little, why is everybody hands in this episode, like, just, like, you could, these girls don't fight often. Like, everyone's hand got, like, these little, like, bandages on them or whatever. Um, I just noticed Biggie's face. This is me. When, I'm on the mat, when she hugged DJ Sky, this is me. Yes, Biggie, girl. Because, like, why are you doing that? <laughs> like... You know, all this hugging and stuff, like, girl, bye. Um, T and E.T., they hugged it out. And, um, and T, E.T., she said she apologized for swinging on her, and they hugged out or whatever. Um, 
you guys, I'm just, uh, Rolly's little, Rolly's black outfit, like, we may, we may come for Rolly, but Rolly's little like, black outfit here, not, 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 not the club outfit, but, like, the outfit in the house, it really looked good, I'm gonna give her her props there, it looked good, so all the girls, they come together in this house, um, is this the whole cast? I feel like we missed somebody. T's not here. That's who's missing. I like. I feel like we're missing us. T. T's not here. She did what she want. Uh, she what she want. So Natalie, she's like, oh, uh, I feel like Scotty, you should apologize. Oh, Scotty, do you want to apologize to Anna? Scotty's like, apologize for what? Cause like, what are we apologizing for? Like this, this is my thing. This whole episode, like, apologize for what? Apologize for what? Apologize for what? Like, what are we apologizing for? For real. And again, apologize for what? So, Scotty, um, uh, uh, Natalie, she's like, oh, Scotty, I don't need to go to the kitchen or whatever. Um, I mean, you guys, um, who, this Burger King bag, by the way, we're going to talk about it later. It's just, like, randomly over here. And I'm like, this Burger King bag, like, oh, that's Wendy's. Um, I wanted them, but someone, I'm like, how, like, this is plot to be here. Because Natalie looks like, yeah, plot. Because, like, I feel like this cast was sort of do this. So, Scotty, girly, like, okay, they're arguing. Scotty, she grabs, like, this, um, glass, whatever, and she's like, throw it. Throw it, sis. Throw it. Like, just throw the drink. Throw it. Like, I don't, I don't get the hesitation. Like, y'all gotta stop being scared to do things. Like, if you're gonna pick something up, throw the drink. Throw it. Like, it, what is it, what is that gonna do? Is that gonna hurt her? Throw the drink. And Natalie, she's over here looking scared. Hold on, you guys. Look, look at Natalie over here. Dramatic. Natalie, girl, you want her to do that. Um, Anna Mac, she gets this... Um, I, don't, I don't really like Anna Mac, you guys. So Anna Mac, she grabs like, this um, the bag or whatever. She throws it at um, Scotty. Ooh, child, these craters eating y'all up. And... Um, Scotty, she had, like, this, um, this chicken nugget in her hand, and I guess she's, like, trying to play, like, doggy on, like, ooh, okay, ooh, fetch, fetch, and I'm like, Scotty, girl, throw the damn nugget or eat it, like, pick one of the two, throw the nugget or you won't eat the nugget, like, this neighborhood right here, guys, but I'm like, Scotty, throw the nugget or eat the nugget, either one, figure it out, so we get to, like, this big room, and Biggie, she's, um, a dress, uh, Biggie's addressing Rolly, um, the, everyone was, like, arguing or whatever with Biggie. Um, I don't really know, like, what, I don't know why, like, Biggie, she's like, I don't know why, like, Biggie, she's like, oh, like, I felt Rolly, blah, 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 and Rolly, she's like, da, da, and they, I feel like beef is not that deep, because, like, Rolly, she's talking about the whole stunner thing, and Biggie, she's talking about something else, and uh, let me, this, this came in my head, um, Biggie was like, oh, Rolly, like, Rolly won't know what, what I sound like when, um, when she moans. I'm like, Rolly. Rolly gag, like, Rolly ain't saying nothing. Like, Rolly, I, I ain't never gonna grow your Rolly quiet. Like, Rolly gagged. Like, Automatic is me, because, like, what? Like, Rolly, I think Rolly's, like, a low-key, like, you know, um, what's that word? I'm trying to think of, like, the word I should say with that. But, like... Oh, a ledge. I think Rolly's a ledge. Like, I think she's like a, a freak, like low key. Cause like she be she, like this is not her first time doing some you know ish like that. And while they're arguing, you got Scotty in the back talking about some let um let me go out there. Rolly's my friend. And the security's like, look at you. Cause like Scotty, look at you, girl. Like for real. Like look at you. They didn't have to air that. Like they did not have to air that part. Like we could have did without that clip. Like dang, like they be playing on Scotty's top. And so um. Rolly, she started like, we fly high, dun dun, ever rolling. And then DJ's guy, I mean, not DJ, but regular, um, Titus guy's like, bowling. It's the East Coast thing. Like, Biggie, you're from the East Coast. Like, you should know this, sis. And it's just the East Coast thing. But like, um, Biggie, she gets offended. And then um, Titus guy, she drops her purse or whatever. Dang, Rolly. Dang, this screenshot right here. Ooh, child. Um. Yeah, so the, um, the Tadis guy, she drops her purse down. And she, like, kind of confronts Biggie. And they everyone's face, this is my face during this, like. 
because I'm like, um, Biggie, girl, like, you didn't have to come out of Sky, like, um, Biggie, you're, you're East Coast, like, like, I don't think Skylight was being funny when she did that, I just think it was like, it's the New York in her, and it's the East Coast, too, it's like, you just go to, you get just bowling, like, it's just, this is what we do, like, East Coast, you guys are going to get it, like, if you're on the East Coast, you guys are going to get it, um, I see everyone was upset about E.T. Like when she jumped up and like it's over, and da 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 da. Um, I see everyone was mad at her like why, but I think you guys are like, I don't know. I think you guys are just like just hating on this girl a lot more than what needs to be hated. I don't think E.T. is on the worst in this show. Um, her yelling is over. Uh, if Krishan would have done, if Krishan would have done it, you guys would have been like, you guys would have praised Krishan for doing that because like Biggie, like it was like here's the thing with Biggie, like. Biggie, you don't need an explanation out of everybody. Like, I feel like Biggie, she's one of the girls, like, she, like, needs to, like, know, like, why you don't like her. But, like, Biggie, like, there's some people that just don't like you because you're you. There's some people that are just haters. Like, there's some people that just cannot stand you. And, like, once you don't like someone, everything they do it just annoys you. And I feel like with Rolly, like, Rolly, I don't know if she's a hater of Biggie, but, like, Rolly just don't like you, girl. Like, Rolly's not going to like you. And there's nothing you can do about it. Like, just Rolly's not going to like you. And Biggie, she got to accept that. Like, Rolly's just not going to like you. You're not her cup of tea. And that's what it is. And I feel like on Rolly's part, if Rolly just said, like, oh, like, I don't like her because, like, she's annoying, we would respect that a lot more than you talking about Stunner Girl. Because, like, Stunner Girl, you follow Stunner Girl how many times? Stunner, Stunner, like, Stunner snatched you up three times. So I'm like, I'm talking about um, Rolly. So I'm like, um, you're defending Biggie. I mean, you're defending Stunner. I'm on nobody's side, you guys. I don't, I'm not Team Biggie or Team Rolly. Uh, they're both. Mm. Their beef, okay, to me, like, their beef could be easily talked it out. Like, <clears throat> they don't really have beef, but, like, they both could just sit down, talk it out. It's not It's not a serious thing. It's not this serious. Like, it's not that deep. Like, it's not. Like, it's just, it's not deep at all. So, I'm like, they could talk this out. It's just, it's just not this serious. Um, E.T. pushes Biggie. I'm like, big girl, like, you're not going to hit her back or anything. Like, girl, snack her or something. Like, no. Um, I'm not a fan of really anyone on this cast, to be honest, you guys. Um, so we get to the next scene, Mariah, um, not Mariah, Natalie is FaceTime Smiley, or Smiley FaceTime her, and she's in bed. Mariah told her that her chain is gone, or whatever. She gave it to her sister. Let me, let me show you guys something. Scotland! A baddie. She's a baddie. Scotland, Scotty's a baddie. Scotty's a baddie. She's a pretty girl. Like, you could just sit there... You don't gotta do all this fighting, Scott. You just sit there and be cute. That's all you gotta do. And you're gonna get the back. Because, like, you're a pretty girl. Um, so, we get, so, we're in New York. We get these long scenes. Like, whoever's doing these drone shots, you gotta get to pay them extra. Because these drone scenes are good. So, the next scene, we go to T. Wow, I feel like I'm saying words right now. The next scene, we go to T. The next scene, we go to T. Wow. It kind of rhymes. Or it just sounds like a lot. They got... And why is the way calling this out? T's confessional look, her hair and all this, I just was not feeling it. I'm like, T, girl, like, I don't know. Like, this wig, this, 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 mm-mm, mm-mm. Like, I know T's, like, well, light, but E.T. done the same thing. You guys would have drug her, drug her, because it just was not giving. I'm sorry, I'm going to call it out. Like, it just was not. Um. So, they're at this table. They're doing this recap. They're doing a recap about God knows what. And they call they said Scotty's not cute or Scotty's ugly. I'm sorry, Scotty's not ugly. You guys can um T you got work T T got work done or to her body. Scotty's body is natural. So I'm like, T, you can't call nobody ugly when you got work done to yourself. Onimac, you can't talk. Like Onimac is a pretty girl. I mean, she is they're all pretty. I, like this whole cast is pretty. Like they're pretty girls, but like Scotty's not an ugly girl. Um so next thing we got E. T. Uh, who is it? Sapphire and Rolly. It's everyone's hands, like, Sapphire, like, what did you really do for your hand to be messed up like that? Like, that fight, you guys did nothing. It was, like, this tussle and... I don't know, maybe we get to the next scene. Um, uh, Smiley. It's, this this is giving love and hip-hop. This episode gave love and hip-hop. Uh, we got Biggie, rolling a Blunt, I believe. Um, uh, Smiley and Camila. <clears throat> Camila ate Scott, uh, Smiley up. Camila was like, oh, you can't be doing this. And you can't be expecting sympathy and this and that. Did Rolly get her teeth done mid-episode? 
It was weird to see this. But, um, I'm pretty sure she did. No. But, um, Camilla, she's like, oh, like, you can't be, like, doing this. And you can't be, like, trying to get sympathy. Because she called her out. And I agree with Camilla. Because, like, Smiley, like, Smiley does a lot of her sympathy. She don't really stand on business like that. And she do a lot of street-ish. And then she cries when street-ish come to her. Like, you can't be pulling up to snatch chains and then cry when your chain gets snatched and someone's after you. Like, you can't do street stuff and not expect street consequences. That's just how it is. Like, Smiley, you're from Miami. You should you should know this is. Um, they go to the club. Um, I think they call Rolly's club outfit a garbage bag. Um, they look the best. Biggie's ginger. I like this ginger look on Biggie. Like the ginger hair. I'm gonna show it to you guys. The ginger, you guys know I like ginger, but this ginger on Biggie was eating. Uh, like I like this hair on Biggie. Like ginger is your color girl. And Smiley calls um Natalie. <sighs> okay, so they pull up to this baddies blunt thingy and they do like this little photo op or whatever. Um, the other girls arrive to the baddies blunt. They're lit. The girls that get along. Um, hi T, welcome back. Um, whatever. So they leave all that. And Natalie in the van, in the Sprinter, is like, oh, does anyone need any deodorant? Because, like, everybody goes to this club, we can't be smelling funky. Rolly, 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 Rolly. That was for you, sis. Rolly, that was for you. Like, Natalie, she's being petty. She's being shady. Rolly, that was for you. Don't look out the window. Don't look out that window, girl, because that was for you, straight up. Tommy caught her three layers of funk. Oh, yes, episode's ending, thank God. So, the episode ended. Uh, we got, we get, we'll go to the club, and what's her name? Uh, Strawberry um, pulls out with Mariah, and she, like, she sees uh, Smiley, and they get the thumping. But, like, she grabbed her hair. Um, Strawberry grabbed Smiley's hair and, like, kind of pulled her down a bit. It was a lot of security. The club was, like, packed. So, they they can't really get down the way they want to get down. But, like, they got down a little bit. But this is Smiley. Like, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Like, you walking around looking all scared. Like, I just told you, like, about a minute or two ago. You can't do street-ish and not expect street consequences. Like, it's not working like that. Like, you're in New York. You're in a land known for chains. Like, that's really how to get down in New York, though. Like, they were really pull up in the club. Like, come on now. Like, Smiley. You can't be snatching chains and doing this. Like, I don't feel bad. I don't feel bad for Smiley. Mm -mm. Um, next episode, we got the craters eating Natalie up in the, in the, in the scenes. Natalie is on, like, this little wig or whatever, like, um, this reminds me of, like, I don't know, this reminds me of, like, Amber from, like, I think Bad Girls Club 3, I believe, like, one of, like, the older BGC seasons, reminds me of her a little bit, um, Smiley and, um, uh, Mariah, they have another fight, like, round 511, like, oh my gosh, like, these girls have fought 511 times at this point, but, like, uh, Mariah was getting, Mariah was working, um, Smiley this round, Mariah was working that girl, um, she was over here bunny hop like a kangaroo. Achoo, achoo, achoo. Like mid fight. I'm like, okay, Mariah. Do what you gotta do, girl. Um, E.T. and Biggie fight. Like, security gonna break this out real quick. But, um, Biggie, she swings on E.T. It's like she missed the hit. Um. I wonder what they're doing like this episode. I wonder like what's going on because like I see like ET's like in her stuff or whatever. Like so like are they trying to evict Big out the house or what? We'll find out Sunday, I guess. Um, and that's the episode. Um, the season's starting to pick up. Like ever since um, T, ever since T got ambushed, the season's been like really going. Like it's been yeah, we're starting to pick it up. But like Zeus, stop putting fights in the episodes. We gotta stop doing that, sis, because like. Like, this whole Biggie E.T. thing is probably at the very end. I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, mm. So, that is the end of my recap, thoughts, reviews, or whatever this is called. Uh, you guys have a good day. Be nice to each other. And I'm out.